Yeah, it's pretty, pretty special. Um, double Olympic champion sounds pretty good. And the last 24 hours have been a bit crazy. Um, yeah, I, I saw that video yesterday when I got back to my apartment. I hadn't actually been on any social media till I got back home and, and Ross, my flatmate, mentioned this video. So I checked out and ended up watching it quite a few times. And yeah, it was amazing seeing all, you know, your family and friends back home, um, just celebrating and, and, and kind of everyone coming together after so long of, of not being able to do that or watch live sport or anything like that. It was, it was pretty special. And, you know, backing it up with the boys today for a second gold, it's just like better than I could have, could have asked for. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's an incredible, incredible feeling, you know, I think pride is the is the word that ke just keeps coming to mind i think i don't think i've ever been been so so proud to be part of a, a team and you know going in after the current olympic champion and former world champion uh, and knowing that the guy going in behind me won a silver medal on that event literally yesterday um you know the confidence that gives you is just is just incredible and i think um you know the, the experience I've gained from that race is is just something that I'll take forwards with me now for for future races and um, yeah just a huge thank you to the other li uh, other lads in that race for for helping us out. Are you looking to are you guys looking to dominate this relay? You're all so young. Can you can Great Britain really you know set a marker now? Yeah, I mean I think like I said we've been getting stronger and stronger. We've reached a point where we're almost breaking the world record and there's definitely more to come. I know my swim could have been quicker. Um, it's my fifth 200 in a short space of time and I think I'm starting to feel that a little bit, especially after the events of yesterday and kind of um, everything that came with it. Uh, so yeah, there's more to come. No doubt I can see us getting quicker and quicker. Three 100s off the world record, I think that'll be ours, uh, hopefully um, sooner rather than later. But yeah, the next few years, we're three years away from Paris and with Matt, 18 years old, you know, Jimmy and Duncan, they're not going anywhere anytime soon. Yeah, I think we're going to get quicker and quicker.